you may have noticed that I'm an admin plus. Now I will, uh, I guess, go into my admin perks and everything, but that will be for another episode. Hey guys, I'm Sophie here for today, and we are going to be starting our brand new series that I said I was going to do a little while back. Inferno Network has re-released, and we are here to start Factions Season... I'm gonna say 2, because the other ones didn't go so well. Let's just say that. But Factions Season 2 of Infernal Network. Now, right now the server is a little bit, uh quiet, mainly just because it's uh, 8 in the morning where I live, and I'm later than most other people, so most other people it's going to be like 6 or 7. Um, so there's not going to be many people on. But um, Inferno is actually growing quite a bit. This guy over here, boss, where is he? Is he gone? I think it's this guy. I think it's this guy. Uh, actually was able to find the server from my, yeah, this guy. He was actually able to find the server from my videos. So, I'm sure that I brought in a few people from here, and I think he's probably trying to chat to me, and I didn't see it. Uh, I'll go ahead and invite him to our faction, which, by the way, is named Cure. So, let's do Boss Rapier. Do, do, do. Might as well invite him, because, I mean, I don't really care all that much about the faction. Alright, let's go ahead and ally up with Ryan, as we typically do. Hestra PvP. Um... Also, ally with, maybe? I think it's ally with. Yeah, that's probably the problem. There we go. And, um, yeah. But basically, you may have noticed that I'm an admin plus. Now, I will, uh, I guess, go into my admin perks and everything, but that will be for another episode. That'll be the topic of another episode, because for this first episode, we have got to create a base because we have nowhere to store all of this good divine kit, overlord kit gear that we've got. As well as, if I do dot slash kit, uh, that's jet, dot slash kit, you can see we've got all these, uh, not these last two, I don't think. Well, actually, can I do kit omega? I don't think I can, but I can try. No, I don't have the permission. So I can go all the way up to divine. And my uh, faction mate just said that apparently dot slash wild doesn't work. Yikes. Uh, we're going to have to work on that, but uh, for now, I will go somewhere through the uh, war zone, and I will see you guys when I am there. Alright, so before we even create our base, we've obviously got to get ourselves some wood. And so I'm going to go ahead and mine some trees down from this little snow biome. How, many, how much wood is in this? Uh, ton, obviously. Uh, but we're probably, I'm gonna see if I can just get around a, maybe half stack, because I, I don't really need all that much. Okay, can you, uh, please stop killing us. Okay, TY. That's the wrong chat. Let me turn off faction chat. So he's gonna get us into negative power. And also, you know, dying not very fun. But yeah, I'm gonna get see I'm gonna see if I can get like around a half a stack of logs. And uh we're probably gonna build a sky base with this. Uh I don't need many logs mainly just because, you know, I'm not gonna be building a massive sky base just yet. Uh for now it's just gonna be like, you know, practical. Not really going to make it look very good or be very big or anything. That will be for a later date. But for right now, we just gotta get started, find a place to store all this. So we have exactly a half stack, and how fast can we do this? Obviously very fast, okay. Well then yeah, let's get ourselves some dirt as well. And we'll use this to build up. So that's, seriously, we, we need to get like as much of the dirt as we possibly can. And I'm lagging a little bit mainly because of all these entities, so I'm going to see if I can pick up some of them up. And over here, there we go. So how much uh, dirt do we got now? One, two stacks. We're going to need a little more than that. Probably like three stacks should be good enough. Because that can build us up, what, 196 blocks, I think it is? No, 192 blocks, yeah, 192. 
So let's get the three stacks and then we'll be done. We'll be able to go on our way, build up our sky base. Okay, let's collect everything and then we should be able to hopefully have enough. Hopefully. Though I'm not fully sure. So, how much? <clears throat> the reveal. Okay, we, we still need a little more. Still need a little more. Alright. How about now? Do we have three stacks? I will check in one moment. There we go. Three stacks and eight. Okay. Good. So I am going to... Which I came from this way, right? I think I came from this way. I think. Although I'm not sure. But I'm going to go look for a base. And um, once I've gotten to a place relatively far away... Maybe I should go this way, I don't know. But once I've gotten to a place relatively far away, I will uh, turn the recording back on, and we will begin making the base. Okay guys, so we've gotten pretty dang far out. We've got to be at least a few thousand blocks away from spawn. So I'm going to go ahead and start by making the sky base, if I can properly do this. Since I have Slash Fly, this is going to make this go a lot faster. Hopefully. If I can reach... But, yeah, I can kind of just do both at the same time. If I'm able to, like, press them right and not do this weird thing where, like, move, it registers me pressing the button, but it doesn't do anything. It's weird. Yeah, uh, let's build up, see if we can go as high as possible. I might actually just do... This. That seems to be easier. So I think I'm going to do this. Because I can build up like really, really fast like this. And so I don't have to uh, go up like one little bit at a time. Okay, we are reaching the top. Reaching the top, definitely. There's the end of that stack. Keep going a little bit. Once I get to Y256, I, th I think I want my base to start at maybe two fi uh, 249. I think that's probably where I'm going to start at, so. Okay, I don't know why it suddenly stopped working, but. Yeah, 249 should be good so that I can build my base up at least 7 blocks high. Because if I'm able to build my base up 7 blocks high, then. I'll, okay, there we go, 256. If I'm able to build my base up 7 blocks high, I should have plenty of room to store everything that I need. So let's mine down to like right here. That should be good. Uh, so what now? Let's craft this all into wood. We need to make a crafting table and uh, a bunch of chests and probably some signs. So I'm going to start with a little bit of sticks. Good. Okay, let's place this right here. And I'm going to set my home right here. Dot slash set home home. So let's go ahead and craft up all of our chests, and then we'll go ahead and mine everything that we uh, used to build up here, because we don't want to leave any traces. And since we did it over sand, it's not going to leave any spots that, like, you can see people dug in, because, like, you know, when you're in grass and stuff, um, the grass turns into dirt, you know? I'm really glad that Infernal's, like, been able to get rid of all lag, because Infernal does not lag at all anymore, which makes me, like, really happy, because it used to be super block laggy, like... Oh my gosh, just the worst. Whenever you try to break, like, a block of obsidian, you had to break it, like, ten times. It was that bad. Uh, unless you used a pickaxe without efficiency. If you used an unenchanted diamond pickaxe, you were able to break it in, like, normal time, but... It was... It was annoying. To say the least, it was annoying. Uh, but they seem to have gotten all that fixed, because I'm using this shovel with, um... Oh, crap. I'm gonna have to fix that. But yeah, they seem to have fixed it because I'm using the shovel, which has um, efficiency on it, and I'm able to, you know, mine through that entire stack, and it doesn't look like anything respawned. So yeah, and I don't think there's anything around here. Nope, it's just that there's this weird shadow right here, which I think is just going to be here forever. Which kind of sucks, but... Hopefully there's a way we can fix this, I don't know. Uh, but let's do dot slash home, home. 
and start placing all these chests around so that we can actually like get a functioning base up and running. All right. So I don't know exactly what shape I kind of want this to be, but for right now, just functional is fine. So I'm gonna make this little like spiral thing and rip him. Uh, go like this. There we go. And toxicity. Uh, okay, there we go. I think I accidentally used a little too much wood. No, I've still got six. Okay, good, good, good. So let's place this last block here, and there we go. Three signs. So now let's... We should probably save these for later. We don't have enough signs to do anything with, and we don't have really have any organization in the base. So I don't think I'm actually going to do that just yet. I'll do that once we start going for, like, making the base look good and everything... I think that's when I'll probably end up, um, that's when I'll probably end up doing the whole organization and everything. But for right now, we just need a place to store this because I'm not going to be keeping, like, three kits on me at all times. But, uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. In a few episodes, I will go through my admin perks because, I mean, you can't just be an admin on the server and then not acknowledge that you're an admin on the server. And uh, I might even start up some sort of, like, staff series segment where I go around, like, spectating for hackers or something like that. Not exactly sure. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, and peace.